think. I think I'm gonna do a railing. I gotta see what kind of lumber I've got lying around. Good morning, beautiful people. Another day, another beautiful day, actually. The, uh, the weather is very unseasonably warm. Uh, which reminds me, I should probably open this. See what kind of temperature we're dealing with in this greenhouse. Whoo, it's like a sauna in here. That's not too bad. It's probably 70 some odd degrees. I'll just leave that door open. I don't want it to get too cold. Yeah, so we have been having unseasonably warm weather um, after the absolute Arctic blast that we had over Christmas. The weather's been really kind of confused. It doesn't know that it's uh, January and stuff's starting to green up that shouldn't be green yet. We shouldn't have warm weather like this. Like I'm probably gonna be down to a short sleeve shirt here pretty quick. Uh, from what I've heard, there is weird weather all across the United States. Uh, it's it's just been a weird weird weather year all that aside I'm going to take advantage of working outside Doing some projects that need to be done if you watched our last video. I uh, Rebuilt this ramp on the barn. Uh, it's a lot more sturdy. It, it feels a lot nicer to walk on instead of that sketchy Ramp that kind of one side wiggled because it only had one foot Yeah. anyways what I'm gonna do today is I've got a whole bunch of shingles, like asphalt shingles sitting down there underneath that overhang. And I'm just gonna put asphalt shingles on here just like the last one had, uh, because when walking up here, when it's frosty, it's treacherous. I came out here this morning when I was doing chores and you know, it was frosty. And so I walked up it and it's like, yeah, slick as glass. So I'm gonna put some shingles on this real quick. Let's see what else I got time for. I don't think it'll take too long. Hi, cow. You have a dirty nose. Ah. Ah. She got you. All right, so don't ask me why this guy had so many asphalt shingles, but there, when we got here, I've thrown away tons, tons of shingles, and we keep digging them up. Um, underneath there, I mean, a pack of shingles the last time I bought a pack of shingles, they're somewhere in the neighborhood of like 80 bucks a pack. Or at least the ones I bought. Uh, gosh, I mean, that was a while ago. So to have that many packs of shingles lying around, and some of them still have the plastic on them. Maybe he was like us and he liked to uh, find thrifty things and got a good deal. Anyways, I've got more than enough to do this ramp. I'm gonna get it all covered so we have a nice, you know, tread surface. I think I even have a roofing nailer, so I'm gonna use that. We'll see. <laughs> Sorry, I'm distracted watching the uh, crazy sweeping. All right, I'll quit talking and start working. It just kind of looks funny sweeping a roof barefoot in January. It's just funny looking. <laughs> all right, got it all nailed down. That's as far as I'm gonna go. The flat portion up there never gets slippery. It's just the ramp for whatever reason. I'm gonna get these trimmed and then I think I'm gonna put a railing on that side because it's kind of handy if we're working on something, I can like come out the door and throw off cuts right here. So I think I'm gonna leave this area open. Also, if I need to put something up there, like when I grab mineral sled with the tractor and bring it all the way from across the other side of the property, it's nice to be able to just set the bucket right there, grab all of our, our uh, minerals, fill up the thing, and then just be able to drive away. So I'll put the railing on that side, I think. I think I'm gonna do a railing. I gotta see what kind of lumber I've got lying around, see how I wanna do it, but 
I'd kind of like one. I think, think it, I, I'd feel good about it. All right, got a little bit too hot down here on the bottom. Kind of melted the shingle a little bit, but that's fine. That is a lot safer to walk on when it's all wet. So I'm, I'm happy with it. All right, I don't have a whole lot of lumber available per se. Um, I've got some stuff that I bought for the greenhouse, for the in wall. I think I'll just use it. I'm gonna put up a railing, see how it looks. I'm gonna play around. I'm not quite sure how I want it, but I mean, it just has to function has to be something to hold on to. So, I've got extra deck boards. I might make it out of deck boards. I, my only worry is it's not gonna be very strong. So, I'm gonna play around and see what I got. Color stripe is going to bother me, but I'm sure this will be covered in mud. Probably won't even notice. I'll be blind to it. Got a okay railing. That'll work. Uh, it's, you know, we're having people over. We're having our hand hewn class in two weeks. The idea of safety issues that we deal with on a daily basis, you know, if it's your own space, you don't care. You learn to live with stuff. But it's like, you know what? I would feel really bad if that ramp decided to break when <laughs> when we have people over here that would that would be pretty bad now i'm not worried about the ramp there's even a railing so it's you know semi safe all right there's one more finishing touch i got to do i'm going to go grab the tractor i'll be right back All right, that is a nice transition. Glad one scoop of dirt got it. The uh, the county had done a whole bunch of work on the uh, ditches up and down our street. I got five, six, seven, eight truckloads of uh, the dirt they scraped out of the ditches. There's some trash in it. Like there's plenty of trash in it, but all in all, it's pretty good dirt. Uh, it is at the very bottom of everywhere around here. So ultimately it's nothing but really rich organic matter uh, and some gravel, which the area I got it from, that particular load had a lot of rock in it, which I wanted a bunch of rock. So got it all uh, graded out, stomped in. I'm sure I'll need more dirt and I'll need to build it back up a little bit, but 
It'll drain off this way. I'm happy. All right, that project ended up taking a lot longer than I was expecting, but that's the way it goes. Never, uh, never planned to have a quick project. There is some other stuff that I had planned on doing today, but I don't think I'm gonna have time now. Alrighty, I'm gonna go in there and get cleaned up and see what Meg and the baby are doing. What do you think, Supervisor? She don't care. She's just nosy. Oh, I didn't know you made like fancy. I made fancy. You asked for a lemon pound cake? Oh, hold on. Pause. Oh, the suspense is killing me. <laughs> Ooh, that is a proper, proper sized chicken pot pie Hello, right there. Oh, look at the steam <laughs> no, it's now. Like, don't I'll touch that. <laughs> That's called blistering hot. It is. <laughs> All right. All right. So let's let's see this. Let's see me drop it on the ground, probably. Ooh, it's hot. Uh, Ooh, we haven't had a lemon cake in forever. You asked for a lemon cake, so I make your lemon cake. Well, we had all these lemons. All yeah. these lemons that are like quickly oh, yeah. shriveling i was like can you uh i know i need to use that this, this is the last of them your parents sent us for lemons christmas. for christmas and we've used a lot of them and this is the rest so it's like okay we're gonna do something with them lemon pound cake i don't know why it just sounded good and yeah. looking at the lemons it was like ooh, yeah. could you make like a lemon yeah. anything yeah like, sure i can make like a lemon pound cake Make a little lemon drizzle to go on top. And Sounds good. Yeah, let's get it cool though. It's really hot. Looks, and then looks really nice. Chicken pot pie. All right, all right. Tonight is a karate night. We are returning to life is normal. Life is normal. It feels weird. Like everything went on hold. Yeah. Getting sick. Like everything. And even just a week ago, we were just talking yeah. about it a little bit ago. It was like, wow. Even a week ago, I did not feel well enough to go yeah. do stuff. Yeah. So. Tonight, back at it. Right. <laughs> okay. Let's eat. All right. pot pie is one of my most favoriteest meals. I love chicken pot pie. All right. I feel like today's video was actually almost identical to yesterday's video. <laughs> Let's see. Went out, talked to the camera, did some work, did a project, ran out of daylight, came in here, harassed you while you were cooking dinner. Yeah, basically today was a repeat of yesterday. It's basically our daily life. Yeah, that's Particularly much... harassing me while I make dinner. <laughs> So, I think that'll do it for right here. We will catch you guys on the next one. Bye.